Okay, here we are demonstrating the Marsh L5000PA label applicator and printer. Uh, this, this applicator uh, is a tamp down type. Um, so as the labels are fed underneath the platen, they're held there with vacuum until a product goes by. And then this pneumatic cylinder um, lowers and it applies the label to the box. Um, here is the Sato thermal printer. Uses thermal paper. Um, this unit has a is PLC controlled, uh, and here's the PLC interface. Um, and then it talks to the computer. It is told what to print um, from a regular PC using the Sato print drivers. Um, and the entire unit uh, rolls around, is meant to go over top of a conveyor. Um, and so the positioning, um, it, can be, it can be rotated uh, on this axis, and it can also be the elevation um, can be easily changed with a, a screw jack uh, in the back. And then we just have the cover removed just to see the, the very clean internals. Um, the PLC controller. Uh, this is the back of the, the Sato printer. Uh, and here's the motor drive along with the two adjustable clutches. And there's the, the rear cover. All right, so we'll try this thing out. Um, you can turn so, turns on, uh, the PLC boots up, uh, and then you have to enable it by pressing the green button. Uh, as of now, there's, there's no files in the uh, the print spool. This is zero. So we go over to the computer. And we just go file print. Uh, and you select the correct print driver. Do the Sato 8400. Uh, then we'll select the quantity of five. Um, and now it's ready to print. So the first time through, uh, it needs to load up a, a label in the applicator platen. So we'll just trip it once and you can watch the movement. So now the, the first label's through, so we'll just simulate a, a box going down the conveyor. And there it printed a label.